Hi, Jacqueline Foster here. So excited to be back, continuing to share my journeys on the pole with you. All of the life lessons I'm learning through Sheila Kelly's S Factor in the Los Angeles area, and also everything I'm learning outside of class that I'm bringing to my class. This week, what I'd like to share is a little bit about an interaction that I had with a classmate and what that sparked for me in terms of just being aware of my own thought process. After one of my colleagues, one of my classmates had finished her, her dance, we were sitting together and she was sharing that she, she had some sense of, of dissatisfaction with her dance because she felt she didn't know enough tricks. And that made me just reflect and ask myself, when I dance, do I feel like it's about the tricks? And do I feel like I know enough tricks? It just had me thinking about that. And my answer to that question is no, I, I don't, one, I don't feel like I need to know more tricks. It's fun, but for me to dance, I feel like it's so much more about the feeling I have connecting with my body and about being authentic and that it's fun to add in the tricks but I'm not thinking about the tricks at all when I dance and can this this can be so shifted into so many areas of our life right how often are we thinking about what we need to know and more things that we need to do and in in having this experience I realized that in my dance I'm very committed to authenticity and feeling but that I still you know I can really take that experience and bring it into other areas of my life to be doing the same thing and to not be worrying so much about how much information I know or about how, how perfect it looks to other people, but about how it feels for me and really the authenticity that I'm sharing in you know a higher purpose of, of serving and connecting with other people. And there's this quote from Maya Angelou that I absolutely love that I'd like to share. And it goes, I lo I've learned that people will forget what you said. People will forget what you did but people will never forget the way you make them feel. And this is so true. I have found in my life this to be so true. And in my experience of dance, this is what it's, when I watch other, other women dance in class, when I can feel that they're really in their body and being authentic, I feel very connected to them. And in my work life, in my personal life, when I can sense that someone's being really authentic, I, I want to spend more time with that person. I want to be more connected with them. Even if I don't necessarily agree with everything they said, I can, I can feel that authenticity. And I know every one of us can do this, and every one of us does this on, to some degree. You know, we might remember for a few minutes what someone said or what they did and thought it was cool or, or bad and annoying, but we're going to remember a lot longer how we felt during that interaction and really what we got from it in terms of, of the energy that we're feeling from it. So I ask, yourself, I ask you to, res to think about this and to see if it resonates for you. And if it does, ask yourself, you, as you are as you're going about your day-to-day -day life, as you're working, as you're in your personal interactions, as you're living your passion, what is your focus as you're doing those actions? Is your focus on being authentic and really getting into how you're feeling and really serving with your action? Or is your focus on how much do I know and how can I know more and you know how do I look to that person? Really ask yourself those questions. Even as I'm saying it, I can feel so much more of an expansive energy around how am I feeling? How can I be authentic? How can I serve? As opposed to this more hard driving, what else can I know and what do I need to share? We perceive that, right? We can pick that up and, and we really know through an interaction if it feels good and if we want to create more of a connection with people. And this is something I'm realizing more and more that the direction I'm wanting to go is in connecting with other people and being authentic and really feeling a sense of, of as I mentioned before, but of connection and unity with myself and all of the parts of myself and with other people as well. 
So think about it, see if this resonates, ask yourself you know, what you're focusing on as you're going into your interactions. Is it about the tricks or is it about the feeling and the authenticity that you're bringing to whatever you're doing? I'd love to hear more of your experiences from, from working with this and even just you know how you're living it now. Feel free to share and I really look forward to sharing more with you in the future. Thanks so much.